All right, hey, hi there, Rob here, robshealthcoach.com. So today I just want to show you something a little bit different as far as the workouts are concerned. Um, not just talk about food, which is obviously super important, but training is very important too. And if you hurt here otherwise, don't believe them. Do lots of cardio, do strength training three times a week, using your body as a gym, push-ups, planks, squats, lunges, and so on. Headstands would be great, and handstands if you can learn them. If you follow my YouTube and you follow me on my blog, robshealthcrunch.com, YouTube is also at robshealthcrunch, uh, then you'll learn everything. So I'll show you today a more difficult way. To, it's, it's all, I do like 10 different types of push-ups. Wide uh, um, stance, narrow, far, look behind like this, crossed over, and so on. This one is, is the incline push-up, which is great. So look, you get on a, on a set of steps, and go, and then go one, two, three, four, five, stay down. As you're staying down, there's more pressure on the muscles. You're not releasing, it's called the negative. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and stay down again. For like five to 10 seconds. It's really burning the muscle. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and stay down one more time. Okay, so that was a quick, a quick session. Normally, I would do about 30, uh, maybe more. So, uh, 30, 40, 50, on a, on that. that's not that steep. But now we're gonna turn around and use this very steep uh, railing here, for which I have to tilt the camera down a bit, so please bear with me. And <laughs> so, give yourself a little break, not too long. Then look at this, this is up to here. This is like a meter high, okay? So, now that makes the whole thing another game. You put your feet up at a very steep angle, and you go. Ah. And stay down. And again. And one more time down, and up. So, that was about, that was only about 10 or 15 or whatever, but I'm just doing it to show you how you can improve your push-ups methods. And for an example, I can also use this now as another example, because I just thought about it. You get up on the, the ledge, which is very narrow, and then you do push-ups like such. You see, so it's basically going into triceps by the bicep. No, triceps. Ah! Oh, that's hard. So you, you've got a narrow grip, and it's working the chest, shoulders, and triceps more because you've got this narrow grip. Plus, you have to focus so you don't fall off the ledge into the pond. Okay, those are three types of push up variations. Difficult. Easiest is flat on the ground or like this. Okay, it's the easiest way to start off if you're a beginner. You get to the table, you get to anything, chair, for the upward incline, and then you go down, do the flat on, on the floor, then you start going into the incline with the leg, feet up, legs up, you get higher and higher. And that's it. That's how you do the push up, that's how you get strong and big and healthy. As long as you eat the right food, that's the keto carnivore diet. Go see my blog, robshealthcoach.com, and visit my YouTube channel, please. Subscribe, share, follow. Thank you, Rob's Health Crunch.